Alright, hi guys, welcome back. We are going to finish off the opera house. So first we are going to send the elevator down. We just put in the relay box and <clears throat> we were able to, um, as you can see here, we just put that in right there. We are going to hop over to here really quickly and jump up. We are headed to get our second secret, the gold dragon. So we're going to climb up this ladder and we are going to use the walk button and as you can see we have our second secret uh -huh. and by second I mean third because we got all of the ammo with it and we are going to pull that lever and slowly walk out there's going to be some ammo here for us some Uzi ammo I will always take more Uzi uh -huh. ammo all right, now we are gonna go back and recall the elevator so that we can keep on moving. I don't know why I thought that we only got one of the secrets. I'm trying to think of where the other one was in this level. Because yeah, we just got all of our Uzi ammo, so that means we got all three secrets. I must have found both of the other two in the previous walkthrough um, which you can see on my channel I watched someone's walkthrough and they were getting a little confused about this elevator and so you have the time to pull the switch down and run inside of the elevator before it starts heading down again um, I think they were getting confused on how because there was no switch on the inside so no worries about that you will be able to make it in and now we are just going to go on our way down. I am going to get my Uzis out. Because there's some enemies down here. That are not the greatest. Alright. They will drop you shotgun shell ammo unfortunately that's all that they uh -huh. will drop they won't drop you anything else uh -huh. okay oh yeah that's right we got the J dragon from the fan section so yep that would be the third one okay we are gonna now pull this switch to send the elevator back up and you're gonna run over think you can get in but you you might be able to but don't you want to get into here which is just in the water. You're gonna light a flare so you can see what you're doing. You're gonna come to the left here through this tunnel. And I showed you guys this earlier in the first part. If we look up, we pulled that switch to make one of the doors move. We're um, right underneath the uh -huh. stage right now. So we're gonna pick up the circuit board and then we're gonna head back the direction that we came from swim 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 this is a place that you could easily get confused on um, but no need to worry we're gonna come around and pull this switch here and when we get in there you might realize that we've already been in this water actually because when we go to leave we have already killed the mouse or rat that was on here we'll climb up onto this level already killed that rat right there And then I'm just going to give it a quick old save right here. We're going to jump up. And we are going to see if there's any enemies. I forget if there's any enemies or not. Um, no. Okay. So now we are going to keep on trekking forward. By coming here and jumping up. Oh, and I know you guys wanted to watch me do it again, just to make sure you got it the first time. So that's why I let go. That was not an accident at all. <laughs> all right. We're going to just jump through here really quickly, climb back up again. Climb up, turn around, jump one more time. And instead of letting go, what I meant is you should climb up. So. Now, we have this 
box or this uh it's not a box it's a this chip and now this is when we want to use this doorway here so you're going to want to come in here and we've already gotten rid of these boulders so no worry to, no need to worry about the boulders we're going to push the switch again and then it'll move that so we can get back up into this area we're going to run around and we're going to step forward and climb up into this area do, 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 do. And what we're going to do is we're actually going to start manipulating the other switch that we weren't manipulating earlier. What we needed to do though was we needed to get the chip to go here because for some reason the chip that we needed to run all of this was down in the, the water. Now we're going to pull this switch and it doesn't show you exactly what it does. It just plays this music. Oh, it's not even going to play music. Okay. Um, what it did was, you can see on the stage, and we're going to head down there, that it pulled the, this area up right here. And so now we have access to another portion of the stage. So now we need to hop out of here. And we are going to come on down here and go take a look. There is going to be some enemies we need to take care of. So let's do our automatics. And let's see if we can get him. To come out. And, oh! See if we can do this without getting shot. We're really close to the end of the level, so I'm trying really hard not to use more health packs. But, I mean... I can only do so much. Hopefully he comes back out. We're going to have some more enemies to take care of once he is done as well. Here he comes. Alright, so then if we come into here, we are going to spawn some more. I did not actually make it all the way in. So we spawn this guy, this guy, and a dog. Oh my gosh, what happened to my health? So much for not using another health pack. Let's just use... Let's use a big one. We might as well. There is a couple big enemy at the end. I am going to show you how you can bypass um, most of them as best as we can. Just because I like to bypass them. Like I said, I like to do anything that makes this game just a little bit easier. And gives me a little bit of an advantage. Uh -huh. Um... Because I'm not trying to play it for like, oh, I want to get every single kill or, you know, I want to get all the secrets. Though I have gotten all the secrets uh -huh. so far, so that's nice. But, um, you know, I don't play it like that, I guess. So you're going to run in here and there's going to be all these boxes everywhere. I'm going to come around this corner and then head towards this very bright colored box right here. And you're going to pull this box out. <laughs> choo, choo, choo. I hope everyone's day is going well. I'm going to try and finish this off in one part, but I have a... It all depends on how fast I play because I have a meeting coming up soon. And so if I don't get it done before, like, my meeting is scheduled, I'm just going to have to go to my meeting and then record, like, a small part of Opera House and then just move on to um, Offshore Rig. Or, yeah, I think it's Offshore Rig is next. Uh, so we'll see what happens. So now we're going to run over here and climb up this lever. Uh, not this lever. Wow, I'm so tired, guys. It's not even funny. Um, going to climb up that box. We're going to come up here. Get a nice view of that light bulb. Come around this corner. We are, we are right at the end of the level, so hopefully we can get this finished off. And now I saw someone miss this as well. You want to jump up to here. And I think it's because their game was very dark. But they missed this lever here because they couldn't see it. So there is a lever here, which will open our exit out of here. All right, so I'm gonna give it a good save here because I this is where I will make mistakes. So probably be prepared to see me make a few. Oh, that is not what I wanted to do at all. All right, so this is the guy I was gonna try and help you avoid. And these dogs. Alright, so I guess we're going to... These are not the guns that I would have out if I was planning on doing this at all. Oh, 
Okay. So this was obviously not how I planned on doing this at all. Uh -huh. um, but that shows you all the stuff you can pick up. So uh -huh. I was able to pick up some grenade launchers and some Uzi clips. And now we're going to climb up here. Uh -huh. um, and I'm going to save it, unfortunately. That's not exactly how pretty I wanted that to go. But that's one way you can do it. I mean, there's no problem with how it was done. It's just not what I was planning on showing you. I was planning on, and I'm going to try and explain it to you guys over here, and how I suggest doing it, because how I just did it is not how I suggest doing it in any way, shape, or form. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. You can tell that this is not how I normally do it, because I'm confused on how to get over there. Oh, golly. I think I can just stay on the side. Yeah. Okay, so this is a really good area for me to explain what I meant to do. So what I meant to do was get right to here where my mouse is, and then when this box was out of the way, I would come jump right here, and then you can get rid of your enemies by running along this, this area, and then they can't really get you much because you're up here. But that obviously didn't work out. Um, so now we're going to come over here and hit this button. And we're going to save it here. Um, because I lost a lot more health than I planned on. What we're gonna do is we're gonna push the button, we're gonna run. It's gonna spawn more enemies, but I want nothing to do with them. And we are just going to run, jump, um, make sure... Ooh. And then once you hit inside this plane, it's the end of the level. quite the same now, is it? Someday you will get a speeding ticket for the ton, Fabio. Hey, it's just a gut feeling that um, may be. You are wrong to look there. <laughs> is your belief so fragile? <laughs> Relax. Breathe deep. The gut, Fabio, has no more direction than a simple through and out. When my father left when I was a boy, he confided to me that he was a light. There could be results in greater than impulse. He possessed the seraph. But he was just a disciple in this design. His death, plotting a path to be sought by the one, his son. You understand? Have faith, Fabio. Not God rot. We are searching the right place. I know it. I believe it, Marco. Good. Heroes, have you fixed that rail yet? See. All right, and that is Opera House for you. I didn't realize when I edited it last time that I didn't really have that much left. I should have just kept going, however. That's all right. Um, like I just wanted to say, I do want to put the disclaimer, this is not a walkthrough in terms of I am the best person playing it. I will make mistakes. I will take damage. I will use health packs. So if you're looking for a perfect run through, I am not it, but I am a run through. I will try my best to get you all the secrets and stuff. So if you enjoyed it, stick around and I will have another video for you in a couple of days.